Today we're installing a Madjax 48 volt charge meter. We're installing this on a club card DS. Included in the kit is a template and the charge meter itself. To do this, we're going to use a cutting tool, a marking pen, safety glasses, two cordless drills, a 5 16 drill bit, a number two Phillips tip, a half inch socket and ratchet, a tape measure, crimpers, wire cutters, and a multimeter. We will also need 16 gauge wire, which is not included in this kit. Now let's get started. Be sure to cut enough wire to go from your battery pack to your front dash. We've also installed two ring terminals as well as two female spade terminals. We're going to remove our seat bottom. Be sure to switch your card into tow. Using our multimeter, we're going to find our 48 volt hookups on this particular cart. Once you know which two terminals you're going to remove, we're going to use our half inch socket. Now we're ready to hook our wires up to our main 48 volt terminals. Once we have our terminals secure, we can run our wires to our front dash. Be sure to secure them to the underside of the frame so that they won't get caught. Once we have our wires run to the front of the dash, we can remove two factory screws here and here and retain. Pop our dash cap off. Now that we have our dash removed, we can mark out for our template. You can mount your charge meter wherever you see fit. Once you have your template marked out, drill a pilot hole. Be sure to wear safety glasses. Now that we have our pilot hole drilled, we're going to use our cutting tool and cut the rest of the hole out for our charge meter. Now to attach our charge meter, we're going to remove the nut and clamp off the back side. Insert our meter into our dash and then tighten. Once you've tightened your nut and your charge meter is attached to the dash, you can install your wires. First thing we're going to do is find our key switch. We have the key in the off position now. I have my multimeter hooked up to my battery pack negative. I'm going to take my positive, touch it to the first terminal. So that's my constant because the key switch is off. Touch the other one. We're not reading anything. Now we're going to turn our key switch on. Now we're running full, so this is our key switch. Once we find our key switch, we've taken a one foot piece of wire, attached a small ring terminal to one end, as well as a female spade connector and attached it to the number four terminal on the back of our charge meter. We're gonna take this small ring terminal, back off the key switch bolt, and install our charge meter key switch wire. Now that we have attached our key switch to our number four terminal, We'll take our main negative and attach it to terminal two on the back of our charge meter. 
as well as our main positive. Now that we have our key switch and all our wires hooked up, we can reinstall our dash. Using the factory screws that we removed earlier, you can reattach your dash. Once you have your screws in place, now you've successfully installed your Majax 48 volt charge meter.